Well, we're concerned about sequestration and, and the impact it can have on the fight against AIDS in the U.S. African American and Latinos comprise the majority of people living with HIV and the majority of the 50,000 new infections that occur every year in the U.S. And these cuts are resulting in fewer resources for the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, for HRSA that administers health programs for those that are uninsured and very low income, as well as the National Institutes of Health, which is funding a whole pipeline of important biomedical research to find a cure and better treatments for people living with HIV AIDS. And we've seen these, these cuts already reduce uh, the level of services and we're concerned that in the, the years ahead, we're going to see uh, even steeper cuts uh, that could uh, literally mean that more people uh, become infected with HIV and more people are affected by HIV. And unfortunately, it's Latino and African-American families that will bear the brunt. Well, you know, the thing I would tell Congress about sequestration is that these were cuts that were meant to help reduce the deficit. And because they're a sledgehammer against spending, we're uh, creating a new kind of deficit for our nation. One that's about poverty, one that's about um, uh, preventable communicable diseases that we're allowing to continue to spread. It's one about lack of education that we're allowing to continue. And that's gonna have ripple effects for generations to come. So that's a different type of deficit. It's not one that's measured in, in dollars and cents, but it's really in, in economic activity and in lives that could be changed uh, for many years. And that's gonna stifle the, the progress of our communities, and particularly the Latino community uh, has a lot at stake uh, around sequestration, restoring kind of balanced budgeting. Uh, and we can, we can do both. We can reduce the budget, but also protect the, uh, those who need our assistance the most and make sure that everybody has a fair chance to build meaningful, productive lives.